from the day our eyes first open. The world is black and white. You do? Or you don't? Or you won't. And dreaming of color, cry yourself to sleep at night. With that longing, torturous longing. We pretend to see anything we can. Dark white. Light black. The ramblings of a crazy man. But see, one day, she caught a glimpse. The red of a rose exchanged with love. She saw it bright as a flash of lightning and couldn't go back again. So love is the key, she thought. If only she had it, color would be hers. So she took a chance, left her comfort zone, and searched for any willing boy's hand. Time and time again, she failed. Rejected. Lied to. Pushed to the side. She saw no flashes of lightning in her black and white world. She thought, what am I doing wrong? Why am I so useless? Left alone to her thoughts, the black and white began to swirl. She yelled all day. She cried all night. She longed for color, oh so bright. She hated herself. She just hated life. And one night, she considered giving up the fight. Her friends didn't notice as she held a blade to her wrist. Her family didn't notice as she schemed of ways to earn death's kiss. But they'd drag her to church, where she'd hear them say, On your knees, satisfy the longing his way. She tried, but got nowhere, cried with no reply, blade to her wrist, 
grave thoughts in her head. She wanted nothing more than to die. But she tried one last time, as her friends and family had said. And with shaking hands, clouded head, pounding heart, she said, Lord, I'm in need of your help. When she opened her eyes, she saw the world as she never had before. Reds, blues, yellows, greens, everything in between. The most breathtaking thing she'd ever seen. And she declared, their black and white doesn't faze me anymore. Before long, she went back to her old routine. She longed for more colors, brighter colors. She closed her eyes to dream. And when she woke up, the world was black and white. with indifference, acceptance. She yelled, she screamed, and she cried herself to sleep that night. Why, after seeing what life in color is like, do we allow ourselves to fade back to black and white. It will be hard. You'll have to fight. But step outside your comfort zone into his light. Let the gospel color the world around you.